Carbon Composite Technology. Uchida. Fourteen years ago, I was in a snowboarding accident where I fractured my spine due to a bad landing off of a jump. I've lost all motor functions of my legs, as well as any sensation. I am unable to walk independently now. This orthotic brace, gait orthosis, was introduced to me during my physical therapy session. A doctor had asked me if I wanted to try it. I really wanted to walk using my own legs since they were still there. There was a chance for me to walk again, and I didn't care how I looked. I just wanted to walk on my own. I've gotten this far today because Dr. Kawashima from the Physical Therapy Research Facility has provided his expertise. The gate orthosis equipment Kazuhiro is using today is called ARGO, which was developed 20 years ago. For his type of disability, a wheelchair or a motor vehicle is required. The leg brace is generally used in therapy to further fight declining mobility symptoms and promote better health. If one is unable to walk, it doesn't mean that they don't have to. By standing, the body remembers and preserves many motor functions. Therapy preserves this motion of walking in the brain by having the patient walk with the gait orthosis. I'm sure that society doesn't know how exceptional Kazuhiro is walking this well with only the assistance of an orthotic brace. Kazuhiro has been practicing walking with the ARGO for 13 years. Since he didn't give up for 13 years, he's able to walk at this exceptional level. His results are a great example of what gait orthosis training and perseverance will produce for new patients. Currently, the main concern for Kazuhiro is the vulnerability of the gait orthosis. The brace will break if he walks aggressively. The results were exceptional, but the 20-year-old design has reached its limit. I have great expectations for carbon fiber since its technologically advanced material were not available 20 years ago. Even just switching to carbon material has plenty of benefits. So I asked Uchida Carbon to help in joint development. As a human being, my dream was to help others with the use of carbon fiber. This dream came true with the joint development of this project. By combining the use of metal and carbon fiber, our objective was to develop a brace that made it easier to walk. Durability was important, but finding out other capabilities was another factor. The target goal was to be able to walk 42.195 kilometers with our carbon fiber leg brace. 
The new gait orthosis will be developed using data from Dr. Kawashima's research and also adopting the positive features of the old unit. Other criteria, such as ergonomics and mechanical properties, will also be considered. With these processes, the project came underway. I can tell it's very lightweight, just by looking at it. The sound it makes from impact shows how strong it's made. The style factor is right on the dot. I get excited just by knowing it's carbon fiber. So this is how it feels. It's pretty solid. You can really get used to this. It's much easier. I don't have to gain balance as much. I can put a lot of weight on it. The stiffness is very different. If I can practice the starting motion, I can easily swing my legs forward using the carbon fibers rebound. I didn't perform that well since it was my first time trying it today. I feel like I can even jump with this thing. If I do this, it feels like it will spring me up. The primary objective with this Type 1 prototype was to replace the components with carbon fiber and improve the original design of the ARGO. By Kazuhiro being able to walk with this unit, I think that we fulfilled our objective more than enough. The fact that he can now use the carbon fibers rebound to aid in his walking has surpassed our expectations. One of the benefits of using carbon fiber is its spring-like rebound properties. The difference between the Type 1 and the ARGO is that this area has been compressed. There are huge benefits here since the ankles don't touch. The ankles move by joints. If the joints hit the brace, it will cause injury. Kazuhiro has had injuries from joint impact as well as other leg areas that made contact with the brace. The Type 1 eliminates that issue by not having anything there to make contact with. Carbon fiber is the only material that provides both lightweight aspects and high strength in one. 
そうですね差し込み量も今長いもんねここを差し込み量だけでもちょっと減らしてまずはファーストトライで The first attempt was to have him try to walk We were worried because we didn't know what was going to happen But overall I would score this project 80 points The 20 point deduction is from this area where the carbon becomes compressed when you walk Due to the inadequate thickness, the carbon had cracked. From this, we can study where the weight and force is applied to the most. We will reevaluate the design as well as make these areas thicker. Our plan is to make this slimmer and cool looking so that it even appeals to disabled women and children. The gate orthosis will feature the latest technology from F1 cars and aircraft implemented to it. The new design will make people walk in great rhythm and look good at the same time. As seen with the prototype of this Type 1, We are constantly searching for new and innovative opportunities. This means that our research and development will continue to move forward, as will this gate orthosis. We are planning to spend all of next year perfecting this piece. Please look forward to our CFRP research and development. Uchida invites any opportunity that has the potential to make the world a better place.